Utah County is tightening up loopholes on the usage of e-cigarettes that will affect sellers and teenagers under the legal smoking age. 11 News reporter Juliana Collado shows us what the change is going to be to make the laws stricter. Jeff Carter recently opened his vapor cigarette business. He sells e cigs of different colors, shapes and flavors. The regulations in this industry are very new and some are so unclear. But he knows that he needs to check that his customers are at least 19 years old because his products attract a lot of minors. But as far as anybody that's under the age of 19, I, they should absolutely shouldn't, shouldn't have anything. Carter and other vendors say they want to make underage vaping into something not cool, since there are going to be new regulations that require the seller to be licensed and check IDs. The new regulations will be enforced starting March 1st. The buyer and the seller will both be held accountable for the violation. Linnea Fletcher works in the Utah Health Department preventing tobacco consumption. Fletcher says there are more drawbacks of vaping than advantages. Lots of studies that have been done that nicotine is one, addictive, and two, the effects that it has on the adolescent brain. Health officials are currently training vendors about the stricter law and helping them understand that there are going to be consequences for them and the minors involved. In Provo, Juliana Colado, 11 News. The sale of e-cigarettes to minors is already illegal in Utah, but the health department says teenage vapors rose 61% in just three months last year because of the lack of enforcement.